What's the story lads? I'm Hollow Gamer and today I'm going to be customising the Benefactor Glendale which is uh, described as a drug dealer car from the 90s on GTA and uh, yeah so it's a drug dealer car as you can tell like it's an old school Merc obviously Benefactor is based on uh, the Mercedes and uh, yeah it's a pretty old school looking car we're going to just go in see what mods we can do for it do it up and I just want to say before we get into it if you showed up for yesterday's stream, thanks for showing up, and uh, I will be doing another stream later on today. And uh, so, you know, if you're interested in that, make sure you follow me on Twitch and come play. All right, for the first thing we have to look at is custom front bumpers. There's only one option, and it's just a custom bumper with that kind of grill. No rear bumper, which is disappointing. Not many options there. That's quite disappointing. But we go down to exhaust, and we have double exhaust, double shotgun exhaust, and a big bore exhaust. I like the big bore exhaust, but nothing beats double shotgun really. Four exhausts, awesome. On the hood, we got a secondary coloured hood, a classic hood primary, classic hood secondary, pinstripe hood primary, pinstripe hood secondary. So that's very unique, kind of a unique little colour. You know what I mean? Pr change the primary and secondary colour on it. That's pretty nice. And the lights will just go for the lights and all up. Stick on the old custom plate and uh, black and yellow. Respray, I oh, will leave respray to last actually. I keep forgetting, so I'll leave it to the end. Roof, uh, roof rack, oh nice. Okay, that's different. Roof, day trip luggage, and then fully loaded luggage. Let's see which one of these looks the best. Well, why the fuck would a drug dealer need a load of luggage on the top of his? You wouldn't put your drugs in a bag on top of the roof like that, it would just be fucking dodgy as fuck. It might fly off. You'd put your drugs in some little secret compartment underneath the dash or something, you know? Oh, we'll stick that on anyway. Got nice little custom skirts there. Stick them on. Suspension. Stick on full whack. Get to the ground. That's actually quite low. Race transmission. And we can change the trunk color. We can go secondary color trunk, pinstripe trunk, and pinstripe trunk trunk secondary. So we'll do the secondary one again. Stick on turbo wheels. Uh, what wheels do we go with it? I don't know. We'll leave it for now. And we'll put on. Uh, there is pure black, but I don't know. It, yeah, pure black for for a drug dealer car. Oh shit! I fucking backed out by accident. Oh, fuck sake, drive back in. Jesus Christ! Hate me do that, man. Back out by accident. All right. Let me see. What else do we have? What were we doing? Oh fuck! Uh, we were doing respray. Well, we'll go respray then. Uh, uh, what colours we go for? I'm bad at picking colours. Always say uh, bad at picking paint jobs. Uh, you know, we want something that stands out a little bit because we're drug dealers, you know what I mean? And everyone knows we're drug dealers because we're driving this pimp iris drug dealer car. Race yellow, maybe? I don't know. Let me see. Midnight blue, midnight green, lime green. You know, we want to do something that stands out, not just like beige, even though it's a drug dealer car. But everyone knows you're a drug dealer, you know what I mean? You don't need to hide the fact. Got to get some rep. Uh, red. Oh, I don't know, man. <laughs> Maybe I should edit these videos out until I pick a fucking colour. But I do, I do them live, so... <laughs> I have to just go through the colours and talk shite when I'm trying to pick a colour. Uh, come on. Right, I'm picking one now. Ultra blue, maybe. No, okay, we're gonna go with this purple. This purple looks nice. And, uh... We'll do a pearlescent on it. What pearlescent? We'll do, like, an ice white pearlescent. Try and get it kind of shining. Yeah. And for secondary, what will we do? Uh, chrome. We just go chrome secondary. We're going to try and match the grill and stuff. I think that looks alright, chrome secondary. What do you reckon? It kind of looks like black. It's nice. Alright, I'll stick that on. Uh, I think we need to change the wheels now, do we? Yeah, I need to change the wheels. Uh, wheel type. we go uh, tuner or we go low rider? I think we might go low rider. Put on some weird low radar wheels. All oh, them little bad boys. Yeah, stick them on. Classic. And accessories, custom tires. Get that white rim around. Now, I really like the white rim. Makes a makes a difference. And uh, what color will we do? The inside of the rim. I love the little shiny shiny center there. We'll do a purple just to match the paint job. I think that's pretty much it. That's pretty much done now. Let me see the final product. Let's back it out. And yeah, so it looks pretty cool. The roof rack obviously doesn't really match it. You know what I mean? You could probably you probably look better without the roof rack to be honest, but I just took it on because it's kinda unique. And yeah, I really do like the chrome and purple. Chrome and purple looks really nice actually. Yeah, actually you actually you made a little nice paint job for once. Normally when I come up with them they're pretty pretty shocking. But uh, yeah, look at the cinematics. Driving in cinematics, pain in the ass, look at them four exhausts, spit out fire. 
lovely wheels, shiny hubcaps, or alloys, I should say, they're not hubcaps. And yeah, it looks pretty nice, do some off-roading. And yeah, I'd give this car a good, uh, good uh, 6 out of 10 maybe, yeah, do you know what I mean? It's not the fastest, it would be cool to cruise around in a GTA 5 online, probably worth getting in your garage. So uh, if you like this video guys, make sure you hit that like button, and if you're new around here, hit that subscribe button. And I will be doing a live stream later, so if you want to, you know what I mean, come into the stream, get involved, make sure you check out my Twitch in the description. And uh, thanks for watching. See ya!